What you don't know about Uluru. In today's video, we're going to talk about this wonderful landmark, which is located in the Northern Territory of Australia. Did you know that Uluru is taller than the Eiffel Tower and many other significant building sites within the world? Towering at over 348 metres above the surrounding plains, Uluru is taller than several famous buildings around the world, which also includes the Chrysler Building in New York. So how long does it take to walk around the base of Uluru? The base of Uluru is 3.6 kilometres long and 1.9 kilometres wide, with a total circumference of 9.4 kilometres. This incredible walk around the base takes you through a surprising variety of different landscapes and is best attempted in the morning when the desert heat isn't at its highest. Aboriginal people have called the area home for at least 30,000 years. As Australians, we recognise that this land belongs to them. William Goss was the first European to set eyes on Uluru in 1873. He named it Ayers Rock after the Chief Secretary of South Australia. In 2002, the names were switched around to prioritise the Aboriginal name. These days, while it's officially called Uluru or Ayers Rock, most people call it Uluru. Uluru is also home to a surprising amount of flora and fauna. In the surrounding areas, it hosts over 400 plant species, which have many traditional uses for the Anangu culture as food, medicine and tools. There are also many animals which call this home, including 21 species of mammals such as red kangaroos and the spinifex hopping mouse, as well as dingoes. Uluru receives around 300 millimetres of rain on average each year, creating waterfalls and bringing new life to the deserts. The last climbers reached the summit in October 2019 when climbing was officially banned and the chain guide that was fastened to the rock was permanently removed. It is also listed under two categories on the World Heritage listings. In 1987, Uluru was added to the World Heritage list for its unique geology and in 1997, the rock's cultural significance to the Aboriginal people was also recognised. Want to discover more about Australia? Subscribe to our channel.